tips and tricks on how to prepare for campus placement aptitude test. Before the discussion, let me tell you the reason for conducting aptitude test. It is important for recruiters to assess the skills and abilities of candidates because these often reflect the capacity to do the job. Assessing these skills through an aptitude test can help them to highlight the exemplary candidates who can really make a valuable contribution to the future of the company. The aptitude test majorly consists of four sections. They are quantitative aptitude, reasoning ability, verbal ability, then technical. Now, in this video, I will explain the important tips and tricks on cracking quantitative and reasoning part. Quantitative aptitude consists of number system, ratio proportions, time and work, percentages, profit and loss, discount, permutation and combination, probability, time speed and distance, logarithms and series, mixtures and allegations, averages. Reasoning ability consists of blood relations, seeding arrangements, coding and decoding, series completion, data sufficiency, syllogisms, directions, data interpretation. What are the skills required to crack this test? First, you should know the basic concept of all the topics, which I mentioned earlier. To learn these concepts, you can refer any aptitude books or placement aptitude related websites. Second, speed and accuracy, which is very important for solving quantitative aptitude. And third, Time management. If you take companies like TCS and Infosys, you will have enough time to solve the problems. But if you take companies which are using AMCAD, CoCubes and Meritrack pattern, the, then managing time becomes the important role. Now, how to gain these skills? For acquiring these skills, you should focus on five things. First one, pattern and syllabus. Every company has different patterns in their test. You should have a clear idea about that and prepare the required topics. Second one, preparation strategy. This is very important for you to analyze the time required for preparing every topic. Especially giving more time for weaker topics will make you gain confidence over those topics. Third one, smartness. How smartly you become ready for the test. There are some mandatory topics which will be asked by every company. They are number system, time and work, percentages, profit and loss, permutation and combinations, seating arrangements, data interpretation, then series completion. If you know every aspect of these topics, it will help you to score at least 40 to 50 percentages. Always start the test from the topics which is familiar for you. Fourth one, learning shortcuts. Before this, you have to know about QSPV, which is question setter point of view. The person will set a question by assuming an approach for the solution. If you are able to find the same approach, that is called shortcut. Even you can approach a problem from the options, which is another shortcut. Here comes the last tip, which is most important to clear the test, which is practice. Only by practice, you can remember the concepts and by attending lot of mock tests will help you to improve the solving speed and accuracy. Apply these tips and tricks, you will definitely get succeeded on your aptitude test. Thank you.